Well, as promised. This is the more modernized version of everybody's underrated shooter. This is where the anime just jumps into play. For we're playing Poppin' Twimby! And this time, this is where we actually see the pilots of Twimby. So, uh, what I'm going to do is, um, let's see. Now, do I need Chibi? Yeah, there we go. Chibi! Chibi, I want some Chibi. Anyway, we're gonna leave the game level as is, and what we're going to do is, yeah, that was my girlfriend. We're gonna play some Poppin' Twimby! Cause that's how we roll. And since I am Twinby, I shall name myself I said name my Damn. Yeah, let me take that off. Alright. My name shall be I... Izzy! That's right, I shall be Izzy! Uh, let's see, we got normal, surround, and then go. Let's go with surround. Now this piece, of course, if you have never heard of it, this is the theme song to the series. And... I love it. Option. I know this the theme song is just so awesome just look up twin memories that's all I'd say look that up it will change your life ah yeah that's it Yeah, this is pretty much Twin B as an arcade game. <laughs> Twin B as an arcade game. That's right. That's what I'm calling it. Twin B as the arcade game. And 
and this is where the game gets bonafide crazy. It gets weird, trust me. It gets really weird afterwards. Ow. Now, I've actually played this before. So, yeah, getting hit, yeah, that, that's never a good thing, but, you know, I can't help it. Ow. Ass. That was totally uncalled for! I do not like you! Thank you, Shield. I'm just going to do this for a while. Just because it's my girlfriend's birthday. And yes, I am having fun with this game. Because if, if it was not for my girlfriend, I swear, I would never know how great this game really is. My goodness, it's uh, what the hell is this? I keep telling myself, What the hell is this? and I'm still wondering, What the hell is this? Yeah, um, your fight's with me, sir. You, what the hell? So you're behind all this? Seriously? Seriously. Yeah, sh shit, seriously? Shit, seriously. You guys are idiots! I swear it's the Herpa Derp Squad! Go home! Seriously, go home! Refugees from One Piece? No. No. No, 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 no. No. No, 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 no. No, you get out of here. You have just insulted me. No, get out of here. And as you can see... <laughs> yeah, that was um, our hero, the pilot of Twinby, getting himself a geek kissy. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to catch myself up. A five-minute intermission, and trust me, I will be back. Trust me. It's going to be weird. It's going to be funny, but trust me, I will be back shortly. <laughs> Welcome back to Let's Play Poppin' Twimby. I did forgot to do the whole thing over. Well, actually, no, I didn't. Options! Options are always good. I like the bomb stuff, you know? Did I forget to mention that? I like the bomb stuff. 
And that's okay for me to actually screw up as much as I like now. Oh yeah, there we go. We got the way motion beam going. Three way. Three way. <clears throat> yeah, it is lucky, isn't it? Fortunate for some, but for Twin B, it's lucky. I'm lagging a bit, but not as bad. <sighs> the, the only th time I really don't like having up updates Thank you. I was kind of worried there because I was wondering when I was going to finish this thing. Oh, yeah. Chibis! Go, my little tweeny bees! Option. That works too. That works, that always works. But yes, there's nothing better than just saying I like Twinby. I mean, my girlfriend has simply made me a fan of the series. Because I actually did this, I originally did this as a, as a request. But now that I'm returning, you know, back to this game, well, this game, being as challenging as it is, holds a little special place in my heart. Oh, look at that. You get out of here. Get out of here. Shield. No. Three way. Okay. Yeah, I'm currently getting an email about Sailor Moon and that story. Which I'm glad I actually did do that. Because I think every every other LP -er who hasn't done that or they have done it, they admit to it that they did finish it. But the real question is how many actually did a full 100% run? I remember the first time when I actually played that on emulate on well Dreamcast via emulation. I won with only ninety eight percent of the um puzzle done. And I really didn't realize it until 
some time ago that I missed two two pieces, and they were in the in the um in the senshi um. They were in the senshi um chapter. This is when they brought out eye catches. Papa Twimpy in color. Yeah, gotta love them in game eye catches. They are so win. That's what's wrong with. That's what's wrong, man. Not enough in game eye catches, you know? It's like, make it anime for your worth, man. So following this one, it will probably be the arcade games. I'm not doing every Twinbee game, I'm just doing the ones I know. So following this following this game will most likely be Twinby Yahoo. Go my chibis. Hunt for your supper. And my mini bees got shut down again. How dare you shoot down my mini bees? You shut down my mini bees! You was a bad man! And bad men must get hurted! I'm perhaps the only guy around who just actually love his girlfriend so much he do a twin B marathon for. Her. I must be like the most awesome guy ever known. At least by her standards anyway. Don't know about anybody else's standards, but um Hey, for somebody who did Barbie, you know. And it's not even the terrible kind, it was just the one that just... You know, I've done some shitty games, but... I don't know, you know, it's hard to say what's a shitty game. Why am I mentioning this in a Twinbee OP? I guess, you know, Twinbee... Has this thing about being a what the fuck in a not in a in a good way. It's like it's cute, and at the same time, it just has what the fuck written all over it. And like I said, it's in a good way. I remember when I first played this game, I got shot down a lot, especially in this in this world. But again but then again, I wasn't playing it on default.
I must be like the most awesome guy ever. Ow. <sighs> We're flying over the Great Wall of Konami. Most of the flying cornuts live in this mystical land of the Great Wall of Konami. And that's right, I'm bombing cornuts. Isn't it? Twin B is so powerful he can punch bullets. That's how awesome Twin B really is. They got some weird bosses in this game, I gotta tell you right now. This boss... Well... The thing about this boss is, well, he can... He can be very easy. His moves are very easy to telegraph. And he has two laser shots, one on his shoulder, one in which he shoots from his eye. Then he has a turret gun. Plus, his legs blow up and they act as rods. And I can easily make a sweet spot right here. As I am just doing this. And I'm doing this with one finger right now. I'm not doing anything but just let myself get shot, hit, or whatever. And if I was actually playing this normal, I'd be losing a lot of health. As you can see, I'm just staying right here, letting the son of a bitch get shot. And I'm just getting points out of it. Yeehaw. We're above the bubble of clouds. Speed down, wow. Well, speed down's alright with me, you know. And of course, we have the always famous And you made Twin Bees of your own. What is it about you guys? Jeez. You're always making clones of Twin B. 
I mean, it's happened here. It's happening. Twinbee Yahoo. Can't you? So, come up with something original. Jeez. I'm serious, guys. Just come up with something original. That's all. That's all I'm gonna say. I mean, stop trying to copy our technology. Shit. Our technology is ahead of its time. I get bonus points to anybody who can actually name the actual pilots of Twinby, Wimby, and Gwinby. You don't get anything other than instant win points for knowing your Twinby. I forgot I could just hold them down. Oh, there goes one. Get away from me. Get away from me, you damn ducks. You're not dynamite, you know. You know, there are one too many sixes on, on, on my score right now. Could we possibly change that? Thank you. <laughs> you gotta wonder... Does everybody in Twinbee just suffer from... A bunk on the head and they just all turn evil? I'm surprised Dr. Cinnamon never turned evil after getting bonked on the head a couple of times. It makes me go back to... <laughs> yes, it makes me go back to wondering about Dr. Wily. I'm thinking some... I'm thinking he got bonked on the head one too many times and he just turned evil. He's like, Yes! Now I, Dr. Wily, will control the world! I'm sure after one too many Jägermeisters, he just said, fuck it, I'm going to hit myself over the head. And that one hit across his head made no goddamn sense. And what happened? This happened. Yes, this happened. So what have we learned about this game? You best protect your head unless you want to turn evil. So what happened? Oh, I, I remember. I remember was I was fixing the house and all of a sudden... I fell on my ass, and then I bumped my head, and all of a sudden I thought of evil thoughts. Be a fun game to play with two players, I swear. Now, I'd like to do this with two players, I swear, it'd be fun. Okay, where am I targeting? Who is my target? And who's gonna be my bitch? No, you guys don't count. I'm sorry, but 
I must destroy you, even though you're doing your job. You must be the sacrificial lambs. Thank you. No. No. I'm sorry, y you don't get that chance, sir. You just don't. It doesn't work that way. It doesn't work that way. You know that. You know, you're just breaking continuity when you do. And I'm, am I going to be aiming at the nose cone? Please say I'm aiming at the nose cone. Oh god, what the hell was that? Dark B? Is that what you are, Dark Twin B? Seriously? Fine, we can roll like that. I'll just I'll just simply punch you, man. I love that barrier. You guys aren't going anywhere. You realize that, right? You do realize you are not going nowhere. Oh, come on. You just shot my Sentai. Come on now. <sighs> I think I said everything I need to say to my girlfriend except... Well, no, I didn't. I didn't. To my Moo Kitty, you know who you is. Know that I will always love you. Even when the rest of the world acts like an ass. I'm always in your corner. As I know you're always in mine. I really wish you a happy birthday. Well, this boss is one hell of a clusterfuck. It just fires random shit. I mean, it does fire random shit. Flames. Three ways. All I had to do is just shoot the most important part off. I'm not doing this no more, man! No. You stop, man. Don't make me have to shoot you, man. I think I've done blown you up real good.
all this just because one guy simply could not protect his own head. Yes, you tricked me! I had to. <laughs> We're flying over cotton candy. You know what? I like this universe. We're hungry, hungry hippos flying, flying raccoons. Another weird shit reside. Yeah, this is the place I want to go to when I die. Yeah, this is the place I want to go to when I die. Oh, yeah. Yeah, very much so wounded knee, bitch. I want to die here when I'm happy. Right, all I can see is just random stuff just fly in the air with no problem whatsoever. I just want to see random shit just fly in the air. I can go without the. F I can go without the weirdness though, but I mean, as long as they don't shoot me, just because I'm in the area, that's fine. <sighs> I'm not gonna say it, you know. What do you mean speed down? Uh, never mind. Speed down's good. Speed down's good. To me, a speed down's good. <sighs> it finally happened. Pigs flew. And it wasn't done by Earthworm Jim standards either. Yeah, I want to have one of these. I want to have one of these, yeah. Oh yeah, definitely want to have one of these. Reminds me of a dream I had. I had, I had dreams which weird stuff happened. And no, I wasn't on LSE. I wasn't even playing LSD. Maybe watching LSD probably triggered it, but quite weird. It had something to do with me flying. Yeah, just me flying. Not in a mech or anything, just me actually flying. Gliding, whatever, but I was flying, no. I was in the air with the birds, and for some reason... I don't know, it, it, it was just weird. It just suddenly got weird. I saw things that I should have been seeing, like flying pigs, pink elephants, blue elephants. No, you get out of here. Your kind is not welcome here. And I don't know why, but I don't know. The dream was just totally weird. No boss, it was just me just flying through the air. And I guess my mind was just like, having a good old time. Really, you guys?
guys are just weird. You guys are weird. Stop it. too weird for your own good. Stop it. Yeah, it was that weird. Eco! Okay, this area I think is the last area, or it's like the last area, or some kind of area. like the way the power-up system is. Because everything, I mean, every area has the the bell system and I don't know, it's just fun. I might be wrong. It might not be the second to the last area. But it kind of it kind of has that feel to it because it got that epic type of music to it. Stop sticking elbow on me like that, jerk! So I am. So it may seem I am lucky. I'm doing it for the points now. Doesn't even matter now. I'm just doing it for points. Well, I feel we're getting close to somewhere. We're getting close to somewhere. I can feel it. Ouch. Really? Really? No. No. You stay out of it. Well, what I might do is I might do the, um, the Twin B games now and Parodius later. As to finish it out properly. So for this time being, the last one I'm going to do would be for now Papa Twimby. Just because. No, you stop. You stop. Get out of here. Oh man, what did I tell you? Get out of here. Your kind is not welcome here, sir. Get 
DM. I wonder what that means. Dungeon Master. You're too crazy looking to be a Dungeon Master, sir. I can tell you that right now. Dung Maker? Yeah. Dung Maker, I can, I, I can probably see Dung Maker. I don't see you as a dick master. Doucheman? Yeah, doucheman. I can definitely see you as doucheman. Okay, we'll go with that. We're now facing Dr. Doucheman. Dr. Doucheman, that's right folks, Dr. Doucheman. No, 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 you go, you go back. No, I like you people, but I, I, I've done too much damage to your people already. Tron Bond calls. She says she wants her serve bots back. Dr. Douche, will you please stop it? Wimby! We hardly ever see you. But when you do, you look good doing it. Okay, so we are inside. And I do believe this is the last area. Yeah, this is getting really jacked up. Well, like I said, if I was playing this normally, I'd be down to like one to no credits. Stop it. Every one of you guys are dead. Just to let you know. I swear you guys need to stop. You firing random stuff on me is not working, man. It's not helping. Because you guys will be fodder for my bullets. That just felt so wrong. Why am I shooting up baby dolls? Yeah, about the Twin B anime, uh, it's, it was very short-lived. I'm pretty sure you can find it on YouTube or Hulu. Not sure about Veo, but I'm pretty sure you can find it on those three channels I mentioned. Or those three sites I mentioned.
Why am I thinking, oh, I can just tab, which I can just hold down. Yeah, by this point, I'd be dead. Imagine, if you will, had I sped this up, this would be crazy. But then, no... Okay, you guys need to stop that. Seriously. So this one will be an again let's play because I have played this game before. You know, I'm about to break your shield, right? Shield broken, sir. I'm about to destroy your options. Yeah, I'm going to be right here staring at you blowing up. That's right. You know, PI7 don't play that shit. Now we are at the last area. You can hear that holier than thou music playing. That fear me, I am going to kick your ass music. It exudes that kind of power. <sighs> Your name isn't Big X, is it? Uh, I thought, I thought so. Ah, oh, shit. Get away from me. Get away from me. Get away from me. I'm gonna shoot your hand, sir. And I'm gonna stay out of harm's way. As I'm doing... Well, okay. That didn't work. You know what? Blow up those hands. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Now it's just you and you and me and Chibis make three. So what now, Mr. Big X? Not even that kind of Big X, but... <laughs> no. My chibis will destroy you.
Yeah, that's right. My chibis have destroyed you. And your foul ambitions. And I am out of here! Not the time! So that was it. That was Poppin' Twinby. And, um... The game itself was just silly. <laughs> it just shows the dangers of how much you can actually get away with, with just not that much. But still, as you can see, uh, yeah. I didn't like it as much as you did. Actually, <laughs> I did. Actually, really, I did. So, with that, um, this has been Poppin' Twin being brought to us by... <sighs> Konami. So, what can we possibly expect from this? Um, most likely something even crazier. Long live the Twin B series, and long live the awesomeness of Konami for having people like us to play games as weird as these. So until next time, this is PI7, and this has been Poppin' Twin B. See you next time. <laughs>